slide by Eddie Kane Jr.'s channel. Let me see. Eddie Kane Jr. Eddie Kane Jr. Eddie Kane Jr. Why that sounds familiar? Get over here. Um, Eddie Kane Jr., I'm letting you know right motherfucking ass. When I record my laugh, I go put it on no YouTube channel. No, I'm not playing. Ain't no secret. Should do Eddie Kane Jr. Like, share, subscribe. If you subscribe to me, leave a comment down on the post. I'm going to sub back to you. Rip, 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 rip. Now that I'm out. Hey, my people. Y'all know why we here. Uh, so, man, this is my city, man. Um, We have a judge, Kenneth King, from 36th District Court. Um, He has been in the news over the last couple of days, man, went, went viral, you know what I'm saying? So, let me give y'all the sitchy, y'all the, who don't know, you know what I'm saying? So, um, Judge King, he was on the bench at 36th District Court, and there were a group of teens that came in the courtroom, you know what I'm saying? Like, uh, it was a field trip from, uh, from the school. So, one of the teens was notably sleepy, you know what I'm saying? So, Judge King, he, he stops what he's doing on the bench, berates the young lady, screams at her, telling her, ooh, 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 wake up, this here, and that, so on and so forth. He proceeds uh, with his um, his actions on the bench. Shortly thereafter, the young girl falls asleep again. At, at this point, the judge has the young lady detained. She's taken out of the courtroom, um, so she's taken into another room. They make her take off her clothes, and they give her county jail garb she come in the, in the county jail green so and they cuff her up so they keep her detained for like two hours she cuffed up and got on the and got on the county greens you know what i'm saying so eventually he brings her back in the courtroom and and goes up berates her some more or whatnot but always a but little did he know that this young lady granted she slept in his courtroom but this young lady is homeless, you know what I'm saying? She got home late, her mom came forward, you know what I'm saying, like, and just spoke on her behalf, stating like her, her daughter, you know what I'm saying? She doesn't really know the protocols and everything in the order of a courtroom, and that her daughter just was sleepy. Her daughter also has a job, also works, so tired from work, and also tired from not having a steady bed to sleep in day after day, like, they bounce around to various places, so um, right now, Judge King, he's been remo temporarily removed from his docket. He's he's not going to be on the bench right now. And he's going to have to go over sensitivity training. Now, the thing is, the young lady and her mother, they have retained a lawyer, which is smart. So, because I, hopefully now, and it's just sad because this is my city, man. You know what I'm saying? Because this, this was about to happen. They're going to sue the court, and it's going to be the city that has to pay. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be the taxpayers that got to cover this because this judge just being aloof and just acting like, you know what I'm saying, that he runs everything. But that's why it's important to try to treat people how you want to be treated because you just never know what people are going through. I know it's no way that he knew that this young lady was homeless, but the way he reacted, he didn't even give her a chance to speak on it or nothing and just had a had an action. Babe, but guess this action got a reaction. So now I'm hoping they A, I hope they are able to get a home after this, you know what I'm saying? They deserve it. They've been out here being embarrassed. Their name is out here. But Judge Kenneth King, it's not a good look for you or the city, man, or the judicial system, man. It's already mistrust for authority figures, you know what I'm saying, and for courts of law. And they just take it, you know what I'm saying, another straw on the camel's back, you know what I'm saying? But hey, that's just how I see it. Should do Eddie Kane Jr. You ain't no renegade. Hit that sub button. You want to join us for the low key. Innocent until proven guilty mission. Hit that join button. Welcome to the renegades. Ooh. Two youths. Uh, uh, two what? Uh oh, what was that word? Uh, what word? Two what? What? Did you say youths? Yeah, two youths. What is a ute? Oh, excuse me, Your Honor. Two youths.